solve for x. What we're dealing with here is what's called an inscribed angle. Okay, we're used to seeing central angles. An inscribed angle is an angle where all three parts, the vertex primarily, is attached to the circle. Now, don't lose sleep. If I were to say A, B, C, the inscribed angle, okay, so the measure of angle A, B, C is going to be half of the intercepted arc, half of A, C. So if A, C was like, I don't know, 60, you would be 30, okay? So the way I'm going to view this is this guy, this inscribed angle is going to be half of 192. So I made that really big. Now I have to get rid of it. I'm going to set up the equation 31x plus 3. 31x plus 3 is half of 192. So 31x plus 3 hasn't changed yet. Half of 192 is 96. Now I have a two-step equation. Minus 3, minus 3, cross you out, 31x equals 93. Divide both sides by 31, divide both sides by 31, and x equals 3. Okay, which is what I was supposed to do, find x, don't need to go any further. But if I wanted to check my work, I could do 31 times 3 is 93, 93 plus 3 is 96, which is half of 192, what I was trying to find in the first place. Fantastic!